Hey guys, it's Rolfie here, and we're here to have a look at the Tough-Ass Chairs Trunk. This is the classic, heavy-duty, iconic folding camp chairs. This is the this is the badass of the trunk heavy-duty uh, range. So to start with, let's have a look at the um, the structure of the chair. What gives it its uh, its huge uh, load bearing capacity and its and its strength? What you've got here is a 22 mil uh, matte powder coated steel frame, quality steel. Good, good diameter on it, and, and the matte powder coating will help that uh, protect that from rust over a long period of time, which is great. And then what you've got is this quad leg design. You won't see this on a lot of uh, cam chairs. Only the high end, heavy duty chairs will feature this, which basically is a two extra vertical legs at the front, which go from the uh, the, the feet plate right up to the, um, the 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 base mount under the under the seat on both sides. So that gives it its extra strength uh, throughout. It makes a big difference. And in addition to that, what we've also got is these cross brace frame hubs. One on the front and one on either side. So these are a huge feature which add to the uh, torsional rigidity of the chair design and also the, the lateral stability, stop it wobbling around from side to side. So if you're giving it a real pounding, these features are what really separates uh, a cheap cam chair from a, from a high-end uh, quality cam chair. So in addition to that, when we get to the, uh, the fabric, this is a 600 uh, denier polyester heavy duty, which again makes a big difference. Uh, it's double the, uh, the the density of most uh, polyesters. Uh, it won't go brittle and tear over time. Everything's double stitched, so that's that's again going to add to the durability and longevity of this uh, chair design. Which obviously, for the luxury side of it, features uh, great padding uh, throughout the seat, the back, and the cushion. So if you're going to spend a, a fair amount of time in a chair, you're going to want some padding on your ass because it's going to get pretty uncomfortable after a while. That actually makes a big difference. Um, <clears throat> and then we'll have a look at the uh, the features of it here. What we've got in uh, in this arm uh, is your stubby holder, which you'll obviously nearly every camp chair will have one of them. What they don't typically have is a fabric stubby holder, which is lined and insulated with a drain in there as well, probably uh, welded into that seam. So that's not going to come through. If you had a mesh one there, what they tend to do is just tear off and break. So that makes a big difference. And the time it takes you to drink a stubby, What's that? Two and a half minutes, three minutes. That's actually going to make a difference and keep that cool. So that's that's quite an effective little tool. What you got here, of course, is a stem glass, stem wine glass holder, which you don't find on a lot of um, cam chairs. That actually is a really good feature. So you can put your long wine glass in there. You won't spruce your razz all over the ground, which is really annoying. So a stem wine glass holder, great little feature to have. In addition to that, you've also got a cast alloy um, stubby opener which is great to have. So you're pretty much covered for whatever your drink of fancy is there in your features. On the other side of the chair, what we've got is a storage compartment. So uh, here you've got uh, multi-storage compartments to pretty much suit uh, your books, your, your crap, your phone, extra drinks, whatever whatever crap you want to carry around with you, it'll fit there. You won't find a, um, a cooler bag under here, which a lot of chairs have. Uh, the reason that's been omitted is because your, your cooler bag basically won't keep your drinks cold. If you want to keep more than one at a time in there, use an esky. That's why they invented them. Cooler bag's pretty useless. Uh, and it also adds to the, um, the the bulk of the chair when it's being uh, folded up and stored away. It means it's a, a lot harder to, to pack up uh, and it takes up more room in the bag. On the back of the chair, another significant feature, which you won't find on uh, only the high-end chairs, is these um, armrest strap adjusters, one either side. So this means you can actually adjust the height of that armrest to suit up or down, which is a really handy uh, feature again, because if you sit in the chair for any length of time, uh, you want that. In addition to the triple stitching uh, along there, which is a strength uh, component, obviously most chairs won't have that, and they'll just hold on that ringlet. That's the only support they'll have. So that makes a big difference. On the back of that chair as well, you've got the uh, large storage, which is ideal for keeping the carry bag in there, uh, so it doesn't blow away or whatever other crap you've got that you want to keep secure. And there it is, trunk, heavy duty, full featured camp chair. It's pretty comfy. You know what? The only thing missing from here is a cold beer because that's what you'd like on a day like today, cracking day. Oh, -ho! <laughs> uh, great shot. Nice. There we go. There's a little bit left in there.